What's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another episode of the Loot Stoller Place. Today we're going to be playing some World of Warcraft Dragonflight. We're just starting. The first quest I saw was Aiding the Accord, a feast for all. Participate in a community feast. And then we need 3,000 reputation earned throughout Dragon. So we're going to go, it says to Iskara in Azor Span to participate in the community feast. And then I, I'm going to start getting some gear off of the world quests and just catching up. Like, I don't, this is, you're seeing me like within the first few minutes of coming back to World of Warcraft. And uh, we're going to be in it for a long haul, for, for quite a while. I think I was telling myself to come back to WoW before I did, but uh, we're here now. Let's turn the volume. So yeah, welcome back to the world of Warcraft. Does that old Final Fantasy habit of dismounting right as soon as I land? Check, check, mic check. I don't know why the the camera was off. It's it's on now. There we go. And we're recording. Okay, this is the quest here. Hello. From Pachu. Someday I want to see Azeroth every bit. An expert okay, opinion. Bye. Uh, Jihana sent you to the right Tuskar as cloak. We'll get Lubbins back to his old self in no time. Okay. Someday I want to see every bit of okay. what Lovins needs. I think that I know what we gotta do, Esplo. Speak with Pachu and Iskara. This is, oh, this is battle pet stuff. But first, let's talk about it. I even have a gift for you after we're done with the fun, alright? A flawless Dragonkin battle stone. Instantly upgrades a Dragonkin battle pet to rare. Thank you. I believe I understand. Make sure to summon Lubbins, then use the battle stone on him. It'll permanently make him stronger. Okay, bye. Okay. Next time, bring fish, please. Lubbins. Is that this? Is that what this is? The Jade Bright Horsey? Oh, guys. We, we just got this mount. I decided to get this now. I thought it was pretty cool. <laughs> it was pretty cool. He jumping up in the air. I like that. <laughs> Can it fly? No, I can't fly. Uh. That's cool. It's a cool mount. The J Bright Forcier. I, I like it. Okay, but we need to summon Lovins. That's what we're here for. Lovins. Uh, pet journal. L U B B I N S. This ugly guy. Okay, I got you. We'll favorite him. Look at his face, though. Boy, boy, look at his face. Lovins, look at your face, though. <laughs> All right, the the battle stone. He's now rare. All right. Yep. Yeah, he's rare quality. Hello. And a practice okay, bout. All right. Now that you use that stone on Lubbins, let's practice to test his skills. There's a big old horn swag named Gwash that lives on the shore to the north of here. Gwash loves to fight. Well, play it really. He's super good with other pets too. It'll be a perfect playtime. I mean, fight for Lubbins. Okay. Let's go this way. Oh, that's satisfying. That's satisfying. Is this where? Is this not where? Uh. Uh. The practice bout. No, this is not where. Okay. Where is this one? Okay. Whoosh. Oh man, that's, that's, that feels so nice. <laughs> gouache. All right, we got a squash gouache with our moon-touched netherwell. Get him in the nethers. 
Okay, he's he's already no. We don't need to forfeit. We could switch though. Oh, do we not have Levins? Okay, okay. We'll just continue to spam one. Ooh, that was crit. One. This is the Nether Blast. Blast the enemy with the surge of arcane power, dealing 24 damage. Damage increases by eight each time it's used. Oh, so it's getting strong. This is the boss though. Reduces damage taken by 50%. Fast players cannot deal more than 35% of their maximum. It doesn't matter. He's down. He's down. I probably should have used Lovins, though. Let's, let's put him on the roster. I think the, the Whelp held it down. Let's get rid of the Wisp. No, let's get rid of the Tentacle. Yeah, right, let's get rid of the Tentacle. Bam. Okay, good. But I want Wub Wubbins. I want Lubbins first string. His first string. Okay. Is there other stuff to fight him? That was the only fight. I I know, man. You you got a bloodlust. I just I, there's nobody here. There's nobody I can not not right now. Right now. Well, maybe I can track. Hold on. We can track. Uh, here. Track pets. Let's do it once around. See if we can get Lovin something to punch on for a second. That went great. Good job, Lovins. Yeah. Don't worry about Gua. She's a big old softy. He'll be just fine. Next okay, cool. Fish, this oh calls for a specialist. Lovins is going to do lots better now, but I think he still needs more. I think so too. A little bit ago, I met a super smart dragon scale expedition explorer named Hanako who works with proto drinks all the time. She's a pet trainer too, but I bet she can help Lovins more. I think she was going to the waking shores. I bet if you go there, you'll find her. I'm so happy I was able to see you. She waves happily. Goodbye. Good luck, Lovins. Goodbye. All right. Thank you. That was a vendor as well. So we got to defeat Pachu. Where did he go? Who was here? We're looking for this calls for a special. This calls for a special. Is it battle pits? Yeah. Okay. It's up that way. It's up. Okay. Oosh. Can we make the ledge? Can we make it? No. Oh, okay. Right here's fine. Okay, right here's fine. killed our momentum with that. Whoops. We gotta actually have some wind going to charge up. Oh, there's a battle pit. It's a little frog. It's a swaglet. He won't suspect a thing. He's level 25, though. Will he scale? No, no, he's not scaling. I far bet! I far bet! Lovin's no, don't die. Okay, okay. I don't even think I have a level 25 pet. Oh, that's a, that's a big one. That's an actual creature.
like if you're on the ground, you're doing it wrong. <laughs> I'm trying to see what this pet is. Is he 25? Okay, these are all level 25 pets. Up to the top. Yeah, we go. Ah. Right, 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 right. Ah, blah, blah, blah. There, right there, right there, right there, right there. Right there. Nope, stay on there. Okay, we're here. Fine, this is fine, this is fine. Too. Whoosh. Okay. Whoosh. I feel like I can get up there more. Right there. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. You just had to will it. That's all. You had to will it. Okay, we're going for this calls for a specialist. That's this way. Uh, northeasterlies. Uh, Rakaka? Of Sue Daisy. And swoosh on it. Ugh. Look, guys, first person. Shh, Illa. Ugh. Oh, we're fine. We're really flying now. We're really flying. Put your goggles on, guys. Core condition. We're flying for real. Shh. Oh, this is cool. Rock a go. Something here. A wind seeker of ash. Of ash, you wind seeker. Oh. Here, let's do a warm up first. Oh, we got all the moves being told to us. This is fantastic. Oh, we broke the game. Okay, we're gonna go go. Okay, I don't know what to do now. Alright. Go down to the city. Where are they? to get bound sooner or later. Specialist that is north. First person. Oh, the best 
things fly. And a cloak, and that's what he is. Who that? Who there? Mm. Hey, son, I'm playing World of Warcraft, but I'm actually like Superman. That's why I can fly. Did you see that? You see me flying? I can fly higher. Hachi was right to send you. Look, they got all excited. That's all I'm talking about. Tuna and Face Ripper. Put the one in the back. Blood bite. Yeah. It's right to send you here. I've been working with Proto Drakes my whole life. I don't know if there's anyone in Azeroth who knows more about them than I do. Everything has its use. Okay. Born to be wild. Born to be wild. Born to be. Can I have an apple? Let me get one of those. May I? Can I? A lot of information you need to know. Let's have a talk about it. We can decide what's best for Lubbins. Learn what Lubbins needs from Hanako. Surviving means being resourceful. Um, Lubbin needs two things, a buddy and a battle. Hear me out. Pets work better in teams. So the more pets you have to support Lubbins, the better. One of the best ways to find more pets is for your team to go out in the wild and capture them. You mean like kidnap them? To capture a new pet, you need to battle against it until it's weak enough to be captured. <laughs> then you can use your pet trap to capture it. Yeah, you mean kidnap it. Everyone wins. Lovin gets another chance to prove his strength and a new buddy to fight alongside him. I understand. Be quick. Be clever. I'm gonna use Corgi Vision though. Guys, Corgi Vision. Did you see that? He turned. He was a regular offensive man over there mansplaining and stuff. But then I used Corgi Vision, and now he's like, hello, Corgi. And I can just sit here and laugh at him. Look, he snarled at me. Oh, oh, he's barking. See? He's cussing me out, but all I hear is a non threatening little bark. He's like, oh, this doggy wants to be left alone. Okay, little guy, let me just walk over here. All casual life. Maybe this molten corgi wants to talk to me. Hey, Morton, molten, cor Morton, Morton, molten, dervishian corgi. What a do, little dude. He says so much to learn and record. We dragged through and missed so much. Well, so we got subtitles on the corgi vision so we can actually understand the little arf arfs. And... I don't know what that is. <laughs> like, what is that person actually doing? How is he translating that? For some reason, I feel uncomfortable around this guy. And Corgi Visions warned me of the potential danger in a non-threatening way. <laughs> so now we're going to get the fuck out of here. we got people not TPing their bongo properly or something. I don't know. Is this, is this the problem? Good. We need to get to work, I suppose. Before you go take these pollen... Yeah, I, I heard these polished pet jars, pet trainers like these. Okay. Um, Hanako. When it comes to training proto drakes, there's no one in the world as good as I am. A friend for Lovins. Like we talked about, Lovins needs two things, a buddy and a bat. I think we can get them both at the same time. This area is the prime mating ground for shy flies. If you look around a bit, you're sure to find a bunch. Remember, you need to weaken it before you can capture it with your trap. Come back when you have one. It might be a bit bruised after your battle, but I've got some battle training stones that'll fix them right now. Look, he changed color again. What is this? That's cool. He's got custom corgi skins. Okay. So apparently we got a capture shy fly in a pet battle. A shy fly is just a creature, right? Probably not the big ones. Should be able to just like zoom around, right? What are these? Rosion. 
Before we go the crab fucker, do I have are those rares? Oh, those are zone rares. That's a special looking one. Is that a time limit? Should I beeline it for these? Pro Zion. Forza? Pro Zion. Or Joe the Crab Shack. I'm gonna I'm gonna see what those are after I get the shy fly. Look, there's one right there. Shy fly. Come here, shy fly. He's level 25 though. He's level 25. Uh. Uh. Alpha strike. Come on, Lovins. Alpha strike. He got one shot. Oh, Lovins. No. Oh. Maybe his spirit. Come on, Lovins. Use your soul against them. Use feedback. Oh, no, no. Yeah, that's right. Feedback. Mm. Ilon. Ugh. Here's another one. This doesn't look promising. Oh, God. It hurts so bad. But he's got strong attacks. He's so strong. Do it again. Maybe we can outsmart him. Shit. Okay, okay. This isn't going our way, but it's up to you, Moon Touch Netherwell. You got this. No! I never thought a 25 could be so powerful. If you would have added up all of our levels combined, it's at least four. Like, I should have only... I don't know. Here, let's let's revive Battle Hill. Okay. I think there's something we missed. Ultimate Battle Training Stone. Lubbins. Level up. Old Timer. What? Old Timer. Hey, time for a leash. Old Timer. All grown's up. We finally got a level 25 pet. It only took us like 8 or 12 expansions. We got our pets leveled up now, guys. Okay, we're ready. Lovins, show them how this works for real now. Do the proto strike. This is the strike before the strike. It's the proto strike. What is that? Oh, oh you can't hit what you can't see. 771? Let's use the flamethrower. Oh, we're, we're just... Uh, we gotta capture this one, right? Oh, we gotta capture it. Check it catch it on this side. Please. 28 hit points, don't break free. Yeah, that was easy. Of course, that was easy. Of course that was easy. Um, shot. Okay, okay. Let's get rid of the wisp. We shouldn't need to come back from the grave anymore. Here you go, shot glide. Is that favorite? Now we got two level 25. Fish? I'm not a magic card. It's Gyarados. Let's get a dragon. Water dragon attack. Frost. Frost? Nixia? What is this? Celestial. We could do a Celestial dragon. Little Nefer. Little Nefer. Here, let's do a Molten Cork. Corgi Vision. Can I, can I level this up? Oh, this is a redeemable thing. I think if I go back to the quest giver, I want to say the quest giver is some sneaky. Nicely done. I believe these battle stones are just what your new pet needs. You know what? Take a few college pet charms too. Did I mention you can trade them for good stuff? Because you can. Okay, so how did it go? You've done well, S. Cloak. Lovins is doing much better than his excellent spirits. And is in, and is in his in excellent. Jaihana will want to go, so go, go back and give her the best. Okay. Shit. Expert pet trainer. So we can get a uh, polished level 25 for 35 of these. How many do we have total? I can start upgrading and then changing the quality as well for 35 polished pet stuff. I have 30. If I could get five more. Some math on the spot there. Burps for comfort. I got the, the lootable item over here. Um, maybe it's upstairs or in, inside. Maybe it's a sign. 
find that I can go inside. There's something here. Unknown. There's two unknown items right here. I think that might be my add-on. Or could be upstairs. Okay, let's see. We got a pet stone, right? Did, didn't we just get another battle stone? No, but we know we can get another. What is this? Flying Battle Training Stone. So this can give us XP and then bandages. Okay. And this is our roster right now. I wanted to use another stone on the Corgi. I think when we turn in this one, that's what it gives us. The so how did it go reward? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Wait, this is back at the city? I think I can teleport. Well, tracking, right? Yeah, yeah, well, tracking. Here we go. He's got the Corgi Vision goggles on. Uh, would I wear something that looks like that? I think I would. If it gave me Corgi Vision, I would look like that. I would walk around looking. <laughs> I, would, I would walk around looking like that. <laughs> As long as it doesn't like overheat or something, the, the open like electrical, that that can't be good, right? I don't want it drilling into my eye socket either. But if it looked even that ridiculous, I'd probably wear it. And it couldn't be heavy, that would hurt my ears and my face. <laughs> so it, it would have to be certain. I think even like it gets to contacts. I think it gets to contact lenses eventually. I don't think it's. <laughs> I don't think it's that. <laughs> I don't think it stays that way. Okay. Um. This way. <laughs> yeah, I know we're still in corgi mode. So how did it go? I'm glad you were able to help Lovins. Perhaps you can help another animal I rescued. His name is Mr. Toots. He's extremely sweet, and I think you two would get along. What do you say? You think you can handle another pet? Lovin' lovin's. Bam, 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 bam. Don't mind if I do. Do we get a title? Help lovin's get his mojo back. <laughs> uh, this is wonderful. I love this game. This is, I've missed more than one pet. I really have. Okay. Hands, Surge Breaker Gauntlets. Uh, we do still have another quest, right? Didn't it say, what, was that was that all it was? It was just, I think that was, that was it. Let's talk one more time to Jay Hana. How can I help? Oh yes, they're a vendor as well, okay. Come Got back it. again. Okay, well, let's do this then. Shift P. I'm trying to remember moves here. Mr. Toots, this is the one it advertised. This is why I was like kind of hung for a second. Mr. Toots. <laughs> <laughs> it's an elephant trunk. <laughs> Mr. Toots. Okay, where is he at? Mr. Toots. I can't help but feel a little warm right now. It's a warmer time of day. <laughs> My face is a little flush. Mr. Toots. Where's he at? I'm gonna get rid of the corgi. No, we're gonna get rid of the shy fly. M I S T E R Toots. This pet's not tradable. Boom. And then, oh no, the shy fly is the only other high level one we got. I kind of want to level the corgi up. Let's let's think about this like strategy wise. The Corgi is a beast doing beast types attacks. Mr. Toost is a beast doing beast types attacks. Lubbins is a dragon doing um, a strong versus aquatic. Yeah, doing flying attacks. Flying, flame, and dragon. So there's flying attacks, flame attacks, dragon attacks, beast, beast, beast. No, beast, beast, fire. So we already have fire. We got dragon. We got air. We got beast. Critter. Okay. Um, I don't think we need fire on fry fire. What is this? Beast, 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 bubble. Scratch, rake. Flying. 
We're missing magic. We need like magic and stuff. I'm getting rid of the corgi. Uh, okay, I gotta only overwrite. Okay. So we need to uncheck beasts. So these are all the beast types. We'll uncheck those. We don't need dragon types. Um, we don't need flying types. We got those covered. We could use humanoid, undead, critter, magic. I kind of like undead and mechanical. I think I'll go mechanical. Because they get like the second chance, the, the re-life. The... And this is a little XT, but I kind of want to level up a low level one, right? Because I want to get the full effect of the, the stone, the boosting stone. So let's fully level up. Not an imp. A mechanical? A sky bow? Sky bow. Um, Detective Ray is an undead. Magic is tempting as well. Giggle and flame. Grasp, grasping manifestation. What we'll go with Lubbins and Mr. Toots. Mr. Chill. He's an aquatic. He has flying, fire, and water attacks. What is Moir? Niolotha. Ooh, this is all magic flying and undead i think do, does moir count as an undead no they're magic i kind of wanted a, either an undead or a mechanical but this guy he has magic and undead so this may be worth it Munar's arm this was a cool quest this would be cool to do these are all undead and humanoid face punch punch face punch return to rest shadow slash death grip haunt Ooh, pilot. Water, dragon, water, fly, water. Tempting, 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 primal spawn. I'm, I'm thinking about this way too hard, I know. Singing sunflower is pretty fun too. All fire, all fire. Sinister squashling, stone grinder. Stone grinder. He's got a mix of everything, including beasts. Sun Reaver Microsoft Surger Warbot Just scanning I'm going to skim through and see if anything else catches my eye I'm looking just at the electrical right now um, Mechano Squirrel Squirrel Because they get over to wind up with hair Rack okay, Nuts I remember nuts being kind of OP I think mainly because of the nut barrage <laughs> and the stampede. Unar's arm's pretty, pretty tempting. I like the story and the quest that goes with that, so I'll probably go with that one. Stupid. We got a little raccoon. A moor. A moor. Um, toxic wasteland. And then winter reindeer. Rudolph. Rudolph. Winter's little helper. Oh, Winter's little helper. Okay, I see you over there, Winter's little helper. This has got to be like, I've had this one for a long time. I don't know when I got it, but it's been a long time. I'm thinking mechanical. Mall crawler. This is kind of cool. Mall crawler. Water. Humanoid. And undead. I think that would be good. In place of corgi. Mall crawler is kind of cool. I think it looks neat. Little fawn. I know, I know, I got, I got, I've, I've been taking a while. This is, this is cool. Lightless tormentor. Let's go mall crawler. Mall crawler? Horde fanatic. Horde fanatic. He's all humanoid. And then he burps. Imperial Stone. Guys, guys, I'm gonna pause while actually let's let's pick now because this is gonna be the end of the episode now, guys. Y'all just sat here, y'all sat here watching me go through all this. And we're gonna level it up. Mr. Toots or Mall Crawler? What do y'all think? Mr. Toots? How about I roll above 50 is Mr. Toots. Below 50 is Maw Crawler. Roll. Below, it's Maw Crawler, it is, guys. Maw Crawler level 25. 
Lovin's level 25. Mr. Toots on the come up. Once we get five of the little battle pets, we'll get Mr. Toots up there. And then next time, next time, we'll actually maybe do... I can't promise that. I probably won't do battles. <laughs> but I can do battles. I can do battles now, guys. Until next time. Fair skies and strong winds, friend. Fair skies and strong winds, friend. Peace. Peace. See y'all later. I don't know why that's up. Okay.